welcome to BMW. My name is Ian Robertson. And we're absolutely delighted to be here in Paris. It's been a really good year so far for BMW, and we've got some great products in 2010, and our sales figures are just testimony to this. By the end of August, the worldwide BMW Mini and Rolls Royce had risen by 12.5% to almost 920,000 vehicles in comparison to the same period in 2009. And September has seen further positive development and we've experienced double digit growth for the BMW Group. Now our business in Asia continues apace and we announced back in April that we would sell around about 120,000 BMW Group vehicles in China this year. Now due to an extremely positive development in this market, we're currently revising this upwards and we'll let you have details of that in the next few weeks. Now worldwide, we plan to sell over 1.4 million automobiles by the end of the year. And this is a 10% increase on 2009. And our goal is very clear, once again, to be the world's number one premium car company in 2010. And we've got some highly attractive new products to do that. For example, the new BMW 5 Series sedan has been an outstanding success. We've already sold 65,000 of these since its launch in late March this year. And we are just about to launch the 5 Series Touring to complement this range, and as we know, this is a great car for Europe. The 7 Series is now the segment leader, and the brand new X1 has exceeded all our expectations with sales of over 70,000 already. And of course, the real highlight for our customers as we go into the autumn is the new BMW X3. Now here in Paris, the X3 is celebrating its world premiere. Now back in 2004, the first BMW X3 established a new segment and quickly became a bestseller. So what distinguishes the second generation of this sports activity vehicle? Clearly, it's larger than its predecessor and it blends in perfectly between the BMW X1 and the BMW X5 series. As soon as you drive it, you feel that the suspension technology has been significantly improved to offer an even more agile driving experience. And it goes without saying that efficient dynamics is standard on this car. If we take an example of this model here, it's got a two-liter, four-cylinder turbo diesel engine. With 185 horsepower, its fuel consumption is only 5.6 liters per 100 kilometers, and a CO2 emission of just 149 grams per kilometer. And that, quite simply, is class leading. Now we're really excited, as you can imagine, with this vehicle. And it'll be available to European customers at the end of November. And now, the X3 is going to leave us so we can show you some more highlights. Now, at BMW, we ensure that every car we make is highly efficient. And here on stage, you can see the very best example of efficient dynamics. The Vision Efficient Dynamics. Now, it exhibits characteristics that are absolutely typical of BMW. It is dynamic through and through. And you can almost see the 356 horsepower just by looking at it. But through the intelligent combination of new technology, engines, and lightweight materials, it has a fuel consumption of only 3.76 liters. Now, the innovative design symbolizes, for us, future mobility. Design and aesthetics have always played a key role at BMW, and I can assure you, they always will. Now here's a short film on that topic.
before we look at this car that's just arrived, if you look at the BMW Coupe from 1971, now the new Coupe design was initially created with a BMW designer, Wilhelm Hofmeister, for large sports coupes like the one that you see here. Now the style of this Coupe generation embodied not only elegant flair, the slender pillars, the light roof construction, the small kidney radiator grille, and of course, the kink at the base of the seat pillar. And we still call it the Hofmeister kink, even today. Now if you take a closer look at this new BMW 6 Series concept car, you'll recognize the classic features of a coupe from BMW. The very long bonnet, the short overhangs, the set back passenger cabin, and of course the smooth silhouette and that famous Hofmeister kick. Now in this car, our designers combine the traditional values with trend-setting style. And the 6 Series continues the sport coupe tradition. It is the coupe for ambitious, performance-based driving. The interior, and you can see this later, is luxurious, progressive, stylish, and it is expertly crafted top quality materials. And we will bring this car to the roads in a very similar form to what you see here. And of course, we'll develop it according to BMW Efficient Dynamics. Now you know I'm often asked, what can we expect from BMW Efficient Dynamics in the future? And of course, above all, when? Now for the BMW Group, the next logical step in Efficient Dynamics is electric drivetrains. Now many of you are familiar with the Mini E. Now the next step in our study of electric mobility is the BMW Concept Active V. And here it is now. Thank you very much. 